Hey guys, this is Scott of UFO Sightings Daily, and I found something very interesting, something very, very high-tech, a cloaking device on a U.S. Air Force Base plane. Now, we're at Dias Air Force Base. Now, this is in Texas, in Texas, and you see a lot of planes nearby. Looks like KC-135s over here, which are good for refueling, and these ones... These are B-1 bombers. I used to work on B-1 bombers. And not too far away, right here, there's a B-1 bomber sitting next to a, a cloaked B-1 bomber. Now you see one B-1 bomber here. But as I turn, you'll actually begin to see another B-1 bomber. Can you see it? It's cloaked. But you can still see the outline of the B-1 bomber. Let me turn it so you can see it a little bit better. Can you see it right there? Has the United States Air Force actually made a cloaking device? Now we've heard uh, the military, US military talking about cloaking devices all the time and then suddenly went quiet for the last 10 years. And cloaking on a B-1 bomber would be very, very useful. Why? Because well, I used to work on B-1 bombers in El Ellsworth Air Force Base. I was a, a, a mechanic on, a, on the airplane. I also painted the stealth coating, which absorbs radar, so they're hard to see them. They're seen as a flock of birds. But uh, the thing is, a B-1 bomber carries eight air-launched cruise missiles, or 24 SRAMs, or 24 nuclear bombs. Yes, you heard me right. They do carry nuclear bombs sometimes and I've seen them load live nukes onto a B-1 before uh, several times actually during alerts when I was at the Strategic Air Command in Ellsworth Air Force Base. It's a high security Air Force Base. This one I'm not so sure. Probably also a Strategic Air Command. This is really amazing guys. Look at that. I mean if you zoom out you see quite a few planes all over here. Uh, the B-1s themselves, look at that. There's so many B-1 bombers here. There's so many. And we don't see other cloaked planes, just that one. And there is a lot of KC-135s, I believe. Uh, they're used for refueling other planes in the mid-air. And you zoom out and you see this one one plane over here docked all by its lonesome over here very strange and as you zoom in a little bit more you see the cloaked b1 guys is there cloaked b1 bombers out there that does the united states air force have cloaking technology now now if they did it wouldn't be on all their craft of course they need to keep it quiet a little bit but if it's on this one, that makes a lot of sense to have it on just one or two B-1 bombers while they're experimenting with it. So you can see right there really well, there is two B-1 bombers there, not one. Guys, what's your thoughts on this? What do you think's going on here? Do you think the United States Air Force has not just TR-3Bs, triangle aircrafts, uh, but also cloaking technology on their aircraft so they're literally invisible okay guys scott c Waring, ufo sightings daily like and subscribe